We have received almost 7 million individual campaign contributions, averaging, guess what? $27 a piece. This country is not going to move forward unless we end a rigged economy where the rich get richer and everybody else get poorer and create an economy that works for all of us, not just the 1%. Public colleges and universities tuition free, damn right. That is exactly what we should be doing. I will do everything that I can to open the Democratic Party to the young people who are flocking into our campaign. Let's talk about judgment. Do we really feel confident about a candidate saying that she's going to bring change in America when she is so dependent on big money interest? I stood up against the behaviors of the banks when I was a senator. I called them out on their mortgage behavior. Secretary Clinton called them out. Oh my goodness. They must have been really crushed by this. Earlier this week at the Apollo Theater in Harlem, you called out President Clinton for defending Secretary Clinton's use of the term super predator back in the 90s when she supported the crime bill. Why, why did you call him out? Because it was a racist term and everybody knew it was a racist term. Israel was subjected to terrorist attacks, has every right in the world to destroy terrorism. As somebody who is 100% pro-Israel, if we are ever going to be, bring peace to that region which has seen so much hatred and so much war, we are going to have to treat the Palestinian people with respect and dignity. We have a global environmental crisis of unprecedented urgency. Now the truth is, as Secretary of State, Secretary Clinton actively supported fracking technology around the world. We have got to tell the fossil fuel industry that their short-term profits are not more important than the future of this planet. You're looking at a senator and former congressman who proudly has a 100% pro-choice voting record, who comes from a state which led the effort for gay marriage in this country, proudly so. I grew up in Brooklyn, New York, the son of an immigrant who came to this country from Poland at the age of 17 without a nickel in his pocket. What I believe is that this country, if we stand together and not let the Trumps of the world divide us up, can guarantee health care to all people as a right, can have paid family and medical leave, can make public colleges and universities tuition free, can lead the world in transforming our energy system and combating climate change, can break up the large financial institutions, can demand that the wealthiest people in this country start paying their fair share of taxes. That is what the political revolution is about. That is what this campaign is about. And with your help, we're going to win here in New York. Thank you.